If you guys want to download and install the Crackers Willy Storm Bedrock Port 0.4.8 update on a Windows PC and on Android, watch the video all the way through the end. But before you do this, make sure you guys already have Minecraft updated to the latest version. If you guys don't know how to do that here on Windows, just go to your Microsoft Store and then just search up Minecraft. There you go. And then click on Minecraft Java and Bedrock Edition for PC. Scroll down to the very bottom until you see Minecraft for Windows right here, okay? And then after that, just click on update or install. Before you start on Android, make sure again your Minecraft is updated. So just type in Minecraft on the search bar here. Just click on it and click on update. Make sure it's updated, guys. And make sure in your Minecraft right now, go to settings and then scroll down to storage right here. And then click multi-select and click on resource packs and behavior packs and delete the previous version of the CWSM Bedrock Port 0.4.7. For me, it's already installed a new update, but for you, it might be 0.4.7. Just delete the resource pack or the behavior, the behavior pack and the resource pack for it, okay, by clicking that. And then just hitting on delete right here and then delete okay for pc go to the video that is in the link in the description it's tazos video at the very bottom you'll find it and here just get, get just give tazo more views and then after that go click on more for the description and then click on download 0 0.4.8 and the bowels prototype sub pack here it will take you to the decayed team's website let's go so right here you'll see a lot of projects including the watcher but we are here for cws bp 2.4.8 so click on that and then after that you can now scroll down until you see the blue links right here so these are the blue links these will lead to the media fire download link so just click on the two of them and then it will take you both of them will take you to media fire so right here just go to media fire and click on download ignore this it's probably gonna be different for you since it's like the end of the year so that's why it's like that and then you can just click on save right here or save as and then put it on your downloads folder okay do that for the sub pack as well just click on download and then hit on save or save as and put it on your downloads folder and then save once again after you've downloaded all of them just locate where you downloaded them in your file explorer so i'll go to file explorer right here this is how the file explorer looks like navigate to downloads if pretty much in general if we don't know where your downloads are it's in downloads okay so once you see the cws bp 0.4.8 and sub pack mc add-ons and you've updated minecraft bedrock to the latest version possible you can just double left click on it and then it'll automatically open minecraft but if it that if that didn't do it for you you can just right click on the mc add-on click on open with right here and then just click on minecraft and then hit on okay you can also use or check always use this app to open.mc add-on files which i'll do of course it's mc add-on and minecraft it goes together as long as it my, it's Minecraft Bedrock, okay? Don't put MC add-on files on Minecraft Java. I don't know if that will work. So it says duplicate pack for me, but it should always say for you uh, successfully imported, okay? Because it already imported this. And then again, you do it for, you exit Minecraft, or you don't exit Minecraft. You just go back to your file explorer and then just click on the bowel sub pack, okay? Or double left click or you open with whatever you do. Just make sure you import it properly. There you go. Nice. My webcam is bugging out, so for Android, make sure you guys again click on the last link which is in the description, give Tazzle some views, and then just click on the title to go to the description, and then you don't really need to click more, you just click on this blue link that leads to the Decay Team's website, okay? And then right here, click on the three dots and open in whatever browser you use. What do you use? Do you use Google Chrome? Comment it down below. I use Carbon Browser. So right here at the very set, okay, at the very start, you'll see CWS BP 0.4.8. Just click on this boyo. And then after clicking on it, you scroll down to, and okay, acknowledge the developers. Good job, my dudes. And then you scroll down to this blue link right here, or these blue links. And then, then you can just click on them or, or press because you're in mobile. So, or you can just do is like hold down on it and open new ta a new tab and group and and then for the other one open a new tab and group and you'll see them at the very bottom if your browser doesn't do that i think you know how to navigate tabs like this pretty much normally right okay so the, yeah just just go there and then yeah just click on the media fire links and then ignore this discount yeah very good but like we don't we do we do not need that so just click on this mini download icon for the cwsbp 
main add-on file and then it will download it will appear right here if it says if it says something ridiculous like download apk just cancel don't download anyway so for me it didn't happen for this file how about for this other file how about for this other file for the sub pack so mini download icon let's see if it says something absurd like download apk or something like that okay it didn't wow okay it didn't so if it did for you if it said this for you just click on cancel because you're downloading a .mc add-on file so once files are downloaded you you now just go out of the browser go to google play store click on search and then type in file manager plus make sure you do has <laughs> make sure you have spaces in it okay there you go and then download this one by file manager plus there you go Here's the logo, so you know what you're downloading. And then open. <laughs> Bro. Okay, open. There you go. Next. There you go. And then next again. And then make sure this is blue or green. Allow access to manage all files. Allow File Manager Plus to send you notifications. And then just go to Downloads, man. That's where your downloads are stored. So downloads. And then once you see CWSM, the CWSMBP files, you know, it has the dot zip at the end. Why? Why media fire? Why? Why? okay just why so just go and hold down on each of the files one of them and then just go to the very end drag this little thingy and then click on the backspace and there you go remove the dot zip and hit on okay and then go to cwsbp right here for the main add-on file or the other file and then hit on rename again go to the very end and remove the dot zip at the end hit on okay and then there you go so what you need to do if you click on this it will say open with just click on minecraft and then always okay always so there you go it said import started and then it will say successfully imported if you've done things right there you go very nice so you just exit minecraft once again and do it for the other file so for now or for this occasion we're doing the main one next but for you you can do it in any order it doesn't matter again the ding sound effect should happen for you for me i can't record it right now but yeah there you go it says successfully imported very good job guys so now that you've downloaded and installed the cws mbp 2.4.8 update for your windows pcs and android devices you can now enjoy the add-on so just click on play this is how you play it create new create new world and then after that go to resource packs but here you can do whatever you want with the world but the most important thing that we need to do or stuff that we need to do is to go to resource pack first and then go to available right here to the available tab go to the own tab right here and then enable cwsm bedrock port 0.4.8 right here hit on continue it does say this for some odd reason but hit on continue right there and then activate the sub pack don't forget it Okay, and then go to the active tab and make sure the Bravo sub pack is on top of CWSM Bedrock Port 0.4.8, which doesn't want to do it. Okay, it doesn't want to do it. Maybe because it's a resource pack, it's the resource pack, you know. Also, you can go to settings right here and then change the skybox if you guys would like to. But go to the behavior pack right here. As you can see, it's already active right here, but if it didn't, Go to the available tab and then just activate it manually. But for me, I already activated it. And just make sure CWSMVP sub pack, the sub pack, the bowel sub pack is below or is above, I mean, the CWSM bedrock port 0.4.8 add on right here, as you guys can see. So this is right. It doesn't, I think it, it's not really, you know making any difference when it's above or below in the resource pack. So just make sure in behavior packs right here. The sub pack is on top for it to work. And by the way, for the behavior pack as well, there is a setting. So you can make it sure that it spawns in properly by setting it to, let's say you set the world that you want to spawn the wither storm in to a flat world, you then just drag it here. But if you're spawning the wither storm in a normal world, you just go to the right right here and make sure this thingy is at the right after that go to experiments and then go to add-on creators right here and then just enable the stuff that you need to enable turn on experiments anyway okay do that okay these creator cameras you can leave that off but for these three you really need them okay after that just click on create world or create so there you go we're in the world and you can tp to zero zero to find the house so zero 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 make sure you tp yourself first there you go 
and I am below the ground okay so let me go to spectator mode and then just go up a second so there you go you see the house and it also matches the biome that it's in so very nice right here some people are having trouble with spawning this Make sure you guys get a wither skeleton skull and then after that just go and you guys can see I'm flying right I'm flying but I press the shift key on my keyboard and then hit the space bar at the same time for me to not go down and then as you can see I can now place it the, the wither storm or the wither skeleton skull right there and it spawns in the commander wither but we're here for the bowel so how do we transform this wither storm so we just type in event nad at e and then phase 7.5 right here boom okay it works perfectly fine and now if you enter this hole right here maybe you're using an elytra maybe you are using an ender pearl to go up here whatever it is as long as you get up here the thing is it won't die anymore It'll teleport you to somewhere else now. And as you guys can see, it did work fine. We literally have it. And in order to, to hit this, you really need a command block sword. I think even a wooden command block sword will do. So there you go. Nice. Just get the command block swords and stuff like that to hit it. And then it starts the bowels fight scene here. Or the fight, uh, whatever you call this, okay? My skin wasn't rendering properly. But if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you guys... And if it helped you out... Subscribe, okay, like, share, ring that notification bell icon and set it to all so you guys don't miss any video like this one right here. And I thank you all my YouTube channel members. So you already know who you guys are. Once we get more channel members, once we get more people who click the join button and also this is or the subscribe plus button, you guys will see the channel members on my channel page. Okay, so just just click the join button, guys. It will be, it will really mean a lot. And click that super thanks if this video really helped you a lot, okay? Just to show support. I hope you guys stay safe. All praise to the most high. Read the Bible verse somewhere on the screen. And if you guys want to watch my showcase when it does release, just click on this video that you guys see on your screen right now. I hope I'm pointing at the right direction. But yeah, just click on it. There might be a placeholder video which is a live stream pretty much which is just like a, a, a longer version so if you guys want to watch that just click on it right now